educational media company. We produce five-minute videos about different topics we believe that the world should be aware of. We produce videos about history, political science, just anything that we believe would make a person whole and more knowledgeable and savvy in this world. About 35 PragerU videos are currently restricted. When we first realized that our videos were being restricted, there were about 15 videos that were restricted, and that was a year and a half ago. Um, and since then, not only has the issue not been resolved, there's actually been 20 more videos restricted. And currently, it's closer to 40 videos that are being restricted. And after nothing really happening for weeks and weeks, we kept pressing them. And then they eventually told us, well, after reviewing your videos, we, we determined they're not appropriate for a young audience, which was really troubling to us at PragerU, because if you've seen any of our videos, they're very educational and they're very appropriate for a young audience. They have uh, placed our videos on their restricted list. That means that it can't be viewed in libraries, in schools, or any home that filters out pornography, for example. Cannot be seen in any of those places. Our videos are as innocent as exists on the internet. Four Pulitzer Prize winners, professors from Stanford, MIT, Harvard, Yale, and they still said inappropriate, but we, we still don't understand why. You think when you Google something, everything on that subject comes up. I mean, it's in their mission statement. They say we organize the information of the world and make it universally accessible to all. They don't do that because they don't make ours accessible. When I learned YouTube had been denying access to its platform to PragerU's videos, I said, I think the only way you're going to get honest answers and gain the access that the First Amendment would require is if, in fact, you start getting people through discovery in a lawsuit. I almost feel like we're being bullied because being silenced is such a frustrating feeling. This is not just about PragerU being silenced. This is about another point of view that is being silenced. Tomorrow it's going to be your point of view that's being silenced. Is Google the one who gets to decide what everybody gets to watch? 